first pick of the first round, Cavalry FC selects Gabriel Batar from Carlton University. He moves well, he's clever with his touches, he's competitive, he runs beyond, he shows short, and most importantly, he scores goals. You know, he's emphasised that over the course of the season. He scored 13 in, in the regular season, and that's what we need. With the seventh pick of the second round, Cavalry FC selects Joel Waterman from Trinity Western University. He's got a big upside because he plays the centre mid midfield in the in the U Sports for Trinity Western. Um, we played him as a, as a centre back, and he's versatile and he's a competitor, and he has what we feel next level attributes. Passes the ball well, gets in, moves about the place well. So he's uh, he's somebody you know we want to look at closely in training camp. Hello. Joel Waterman, Tommy Wilson Jr. Yeah. Listen, quick question: If you were to be yeah. drafted by anybody. Who would you want to be drafted by? Oh, at this point, I would say the Cavalry for sure. Well, ding, 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 correct answer. You have been drafted <laughs> by Cavalry Football Club. Congratulations, bud. Wow, thank you very much. I appreciate it. With the first pick of the third round, Cavalry FC selects Easton Ongaro from the University of Alberta. Big, tall striker, left-footed, um, scored a ton of goals um, in Canada West this year. You know, you don't put the ball in the back of that many times if it isn't a natural skill set. So he's an exciting prospect.